Welcome to this edition of A Call from the Stars, A Call to Arms. Chapter 9 Point of View Alien Commander of Watch Station 973 Summation of report is as follows. We have been watching the enemy movements for decades now, watching them come closer and closer to one of our planets and getting ready for whatever assault is going to be. Thankfully, working with the humans has given us a few more interesting weapon systems to engage the enemy with, which has slowed them down a little bit. However, has definitely not stopped them. Unfortunately, losing ships on recon mission is still semi-common. However, what we do find difficult to accept is that the enemy was stretching out in all directions to include heading towards Earth and its soul system. We have been worried about this, which is one of the reasons why we tried to get the humans upgunned and ready to operate as soon as possible. However, our early warning system on the edge of their space started going off and we immediately double and triple checked in our findings. They had reached Terran space. Enemy scout ships looked like it. A small flotilla, too, in fact. We couldn't get a very good look at them, but they warped into the system and they were immediately at full burn towards the humans' settlements. <sighs> We worried that this was going to be the lead to a full-on battle group, and we were correct. We lost contact with the two groups as they entered Terran space. However, it was clear that at least one of the enemy ships had jumped back into their version of warp slash jump space so that they could make it back to their own and recon again. That was the moment where prayers were said for the Terrans. Oh, we knew they wouldn't handle an enemy advance. However, we did catch a little bit of them preparing for one at their home planet. Unfortunately, as soon as our recon had actually sent a signal to us, it went offline. Either the humans found it and turned it off, or the enemy had destroyed it. We didn't have a chance to even send ships. It would have taken us three weeks, almost a complete month by the human calendar just to muster the ships enough and then travel that far to assist them. We had bigger problems. We knew that there was going to be attack at Drega Sector, so we got ready there. At Drega 6, which was the only habitable planet that the Sniffs could handle, we got ready for the battle. The strange thing, they didn't show up when we expected them to. We had actually waited in ambush for nearly a full cycle of the planet around the star before we realized we're just sitting here pointing our guns at empty space. It was then decided that we need to reevaluate the enemy movements and everyone was put on stand down. What is strange is that the enemy attack didn't happen. This is the first time that the enemy attack did not come. Perhaps the humans actually put up more of a fight than we thought. It's a shame. It's a shame that we lost such a valuable ally. They were adapting by leaps and bounds. I miss them. They were funny.